Welcome to Futex. There are two names that stand out in the field of robotics, Tesla's Optimus and Boston Dynamics Atlas. Both companies have spent years researching and developing some of the most advanced robots ever produced. A newcomer to the scene, Tesla, has made a splash in just eight months with its impressive capabilities and sleek design, says Optimus. From scratch, the company was able to design and build a robot that has already made waves in the industry. On the other hand, Boston Dynamics Atlas has been honed and perfected over the years through relentless testing and optimization. With its advanced mechanical systems and sophisticated programming, it's a formidable opponent in any situation. But which of these robots will win? Is it going to be the newcomer with its cutting-edge technology and innovative design or will it be the veteran with its proven track record and advanced capabilities? Stay tuned to find out. Tesla gave an update on its humanoid robot program, which is known as Tesla Bot or Optimus. New images of prototypes were quite impressive, making the project look less like a sideshow and increasingly like a potentially real product. When Elon Musk first announced the Tesla bot, many laughed it off as a sideshow or distraction to Tesla's more important mission to accelerate the advent of sustainable energy. The CEO hyped it up by describing how much value it would create by fixing the labor crisis, but like Tesla's autonomous driving effort, everyone can see the value of humanoid robots the problem is people have issues seeing Tesla making it a reality. At the time, Tesla had a very early prototype that didn't look like much. It was barely able to walk around and wave at the crowd. That was about it. Our goal is to make um, a, a useful humanoid robot as quickly as possible. Musk, who only made a bold statement last year, now seems to be a real movie scene. From the need to use a bracket, he can only simply wave his hand. Now it will become an important boost to the Tesla factory, which shows Musk's determination to continue to deploy the AI field. Tesla. We're, we're the most advanced in real world AI. So the same AI that drives the car, uh, it, which you can think of the car really as a robot on wheels, and this is a robot on legs. Um, so Humanoid robots can greatly increase productivity and replace humans to do repetitive tasks. From controllers to electronic equipment, Tesla does it all. Tesla mechanical design engineer actually is designed by us, leading to a certain actuator design, and that gives us the possibility to integrate the actuators inside our structure. structure. The global robotics market is booming. According to statistics, in 2023, the market size will reach 64 billion US dollars. By 2028, it is expected to exceed 320 billion US dollars, with an annual growth rate of 83%. It's just that Musk is suddenly actively involved in the development of robots. It turns out that he is really dissatisfied with the WFH trend that has emerged in recent years. CEO Elon Musk of Tesla, you may work from home, but people who make cars or food cannot work from home, and people who repair houses cannot work from home, but you may. The highly anticipated reveal of Tesla's Optimus robots left some in the media underwhelmed, when compared to Boston Dynamics Atlas. The latter, Developed by an offshoot of MIT and now owned by Hyundai Motor, is one of the most advanced human-like robots on the market. It can do much more than simply walk. Atlas is capable of incredible feats such as dancing, backflipping and many other maneuvers with remarkable precision. Optimus Twitter users have compared the two robots, noting Boston Dynamics Atlas is light years ahead of Optimus in terms of performance and capabilities. But were these comparisons fair and how much more advanced is Atlas? Although Atlas and Optimus may seem similar, they were created with very different intentions. Atlas was designed for research purposes, but Tesla CEO Elon Musk intends to sell Optimus commercially. Musk stated during his presentation that he plans to produce 1 million Optimus units, bringing the price below $20,000. However, given Musk's reputation for making ambitious promises, it remains to see if Tesla can actually deliver on this promise. In light of the fact that robot development typically takes years and costs much more, this estimate would be significant. The Boston Dynamics robots, for instance, cost $74,000, while experts say humanoid robots like Atlas usually cost more than $150,000. The difference in time observers were quick to notice the difference in the amount of time it took to develop the two robots. Tesla built the Optimus from scratch in eight months, but Boston Dynamics perfected Atlas for years. 
A partnership between the company and the Defense Advanced Research Projects Agency resulted in the company being exclusively focused on robotics. In 2013, a DARPA program manager compared Atlas to a one-year-old child when he developed Atlas, stating that a one-year-old child cannot walk easily and falls frequently. Unlike Optimus, which was designed to operate in the real world, Atlas was created only for research purposes. This is where we are right now, a demo versus actual usage. The Atlas robots are demonstrated in promotional videos under controlled conditions by Boston Dynamics, who admit their robots follow a choreographed routine in these videos. As for Optimus, Tesla claims that it uses the same neural networks as its cars and that, thanks to its processor designed to improve battery efficiency, the robots can run for up to a full day on a single charge of its 2.7 kilowatt battery pack. Atlas, on the other hand, uses hydraulic actuators, which use a lot of power and drain the robot's batteries quickly. Tesla's plans for Optimus are much more wide-reaching than simply constructing breathtaking demos like Atlas. The robot's chest holds a computer configured to process visual data, make speedy decisions based on sensory info, and operate similar to how the human brain functions. It will also boast more complex features, such as hands with five digits and opposable thumbs, these are typically not present in most robots. The robot's hands will have 11 degrees of movement space, which is not as many as human hands, but still a challenging task to achieve. Most robotics companies have yet to explore dexterity and reliability fully. In his Twitter post, Christian noted that it is important to consider how often a robot falls down. He became a robotics professor and the director of the Optimal Robotics Lab. Although Boston Dynamics robots may be physically capable, they're still unable to use their hands to pick up objects. In addition, Zubik noted that a robot's human-like qualities cannot be inferred simply from a video or live demonstration. In spite of Atlas' current status as the world's most advanced robot, there are other robots with similar capabilities as well. Boston Dynamics, to its credit, has been upfront about showing when its robots fail. A growing number of robotics companies continue to develop more intricate human-like capabilities. Among these companies, Tesla is promising the most human-like qualities for Optimus, but despite its limited capabilities at present, it is impressive given the short time it took to develop it. In five years, Optimus will be incredible, Musk said at the events. In 10 years, it will be incredible. Mind-blowing. As we come to the close of our video, it remains to be seen if Tesla will meet their expectations for Optimus. This battle between the robots of Tesla and Boston Dynamics has demonstrated that both have remarkable strengths and capabilities. Atlas dazzled us with its physical prowess, however, Tesla is aiming higher than just creating amazing demos. Their ambition for Optimus entails advanced neural networks and an unparalleled human-like quality. Tesla's Optimus and Boston Dynamics robots both have the potential to be game-changers in many industries. Tesla is looking to leverage Optimus to make their manufacturing processes more efficient, allowing them to scale up operations. Meanwhile, Boston Dynamics robots are capable of tackling complicated tasks that require dexterity and mobility. These robots can be used in logistics, construction sites, during disasters, and in healthcare for patient care and rehabilitation. AI and machine learning algorithms are key components of both Optimus and Boston Dynamics robots. They allow the robots to interpret their environment, adapt to their surroundings, and learn from experience. These capabilities enable Optimus to perform quality control, defect detection, and process optimization with precision. Boston Dynamics robots use AI to refine their movements, balance, and task execution for greater agility and capability. Deployment of advanced robotics bring with them some challenges and ethical considerations. As robots become ever more autonomous and capable, anxieties over job displacement and its effects for human workers arise. It is essential to reconcile automation with human employment, thus making sure that progression in robotics brings about societal gain. Privacy worries, possible misuse of robotic technology, and need for regulatory frameworks to monitor their deployment are all ethical matters that must be accounted for. The competition between Tesla's Optimus and Boston Dynamics Robotics stands testament to the ceaseless push for innovation and automation in many industries. Both companies have elevated AI, machine learning, and control systems to produce incredible robotic systems. Tesla's Optimus seeks to increase productivity in manufacturing 
while Boston Dynamics robots offer flexible solutions for complicated jobs. As these technologies continue to progress, it is crucial to evaluate the moral implications and guarantee that robotics and automation are beneficial to society as a whole. Although it is exciting to see what the future holds for this robot, since we continue to see advances in robotics and artificial intelligence, it is impossible to predict how it will turn out. Time will tell if we will ever see a true showdown between these two robots. What are your thoughts on Tesla's Optimus and Boston Dynamics Atlas? Thanks for watching.